Place value is a difficult concept for some students to understand, but it's very important in their development of math. The Ontario curriculum defines place value as the value of a digit that appears in a number. The value depends on the position or place in which the digit appears in the number. And they provide an example as shown below. Place value, again, is a difficult concept, but is important throughout many of the grades of school. And it starts at a simpler level, for example, with a three-digit number or even a two-digit number in our younger primary grades. And students have to understand that there's a number in the ones place, the tens place, and the hundreds place. In Ontario, when students grade, reach grade four, they begin to add into decimal numbers. And they have to understand that there's place value even after the decimal point, such as the tenths place in grade four, the hundredths place in grade five, and the thousandths place in grade six, Ontario curriculum. However, it even goes beyond that and can become much more complicated for students. For example, here's the place value chart for the 210,987,654,321 and 23,466,000ths. That's a mouthful. It's no wonder that some students get confused with place value, which is why it's important that students are exposed to it and have time to practice it. One skill or tool that really helps students is the hundreds chart. The hundreds chart just arranges the first hundred numbers in an array of 10 by 10. So there's 10 rows and the numbers are ordered sequentially to help them understand that they get bigger and the place value changes as the digits change representing a different value for the number. Another way students can practice place value at home is by using a chart such as the one below the place value house and having them arrange different numbers or for example the different numbered cards in a playing deck to create different numbers and tell their parent what number they created or they can take turns and their parent can create a number and the students can tell them what number they created. Finally, another skill students work on with place value in school is representing the different forms of the number. So for example, standard form is the number just written, such as 572. But to practice place value, students are often asked to write it in expanded form, where they write each value of the number individually. So they write the 500 plus the 70 and plus the 2. And finally, students usually are asked to write it in written form, where they write the number in words, 572.